This question is from Rahola. Rahola asks, why does my tinnitus get louder some days? I don't feel more stressed, nor do I have hearing loss. Tinnitus is a tricky medical condition. There's absolutely no denying that. Sometimes it's louder and we don't have a specific reason as to why. Let's unpack that a little further. So what are the possible reasons that tinnitus can get louder? Well, there's systems in the psychological centers of the brain. There's systems in the central nervous system of the body, also called the autonomic nervous system. And then there's subtle changes to the body, things like anxiety, stress, hormones, different kinds of changes to your diet, physical health. All of this can influence the sensitive condition of tinnitus. So exactly why does your tinnitus get louder some days? Without knowing your full history, I couldn't give you a strong recommendation as to why. I couldn't give you a strong analysis as to why. However, if you unpack it, it could be something related to sound, being in silent places or being around loud sound. It could be something with subtle stress or anxieties with your work life, with your interpersonal relationships, your family. It could be something related to sleep. But I must be honest that sometimes we don't know. We don't know why tinnitus fluctuates louder some days, quieter others. Sometimes we can't exactly pinpoint it. That said, don't let this stop you from getting better. Don't let this stop you from improving your tinnitus. It's an important point. Don't let something make you feel stuck, right? It's par for the course for tinnitus to, for some manifestations of it, to say, look, I don't know why I'm having some bad days. I don't know why it's louder some days than others, right? But I accept that. I'm not trying to solve this. I'm not trying to fix it. I don't want it to be there. It's not a positive thing. I don't love this, but I'm not trying to resist it. I'm not trying to make it more intense than it has to be. Those kinds of cognitive tools are without a doubt useful in managing this condition. That's what I help people with. That's what I coach people with. That's why CBT can help someone. It's these kinds of cognitive tools are so important. All right. So thank you for your question.